welcome and this tutorial is part of the evaluation which is worth 14 marks so section two is on the description of the suitability and effectiveness of the features that you're going to need to analyze so you research multimedia online is part of your research which was 12 marks at the beginning so you will need to talk about what did you research so you should have as part of your research you researched different um, multimedia features online so it could have been a movie it could have been web icons it could have been um, animations lots of different things that you've got online uh, you will need to have analyzed to talk about and compared different websites to each other all right so when you looked at something like a children's website it could be Nickelodeon CBBS what was on there compared to uh, a professional website like a bank or a lawyer all right so you did lots of research what were the difference depending on the target audience so you just talk about it you know give a brief of what you've already done and bring it down into evaluation i found that on a children's website you know they tended to have a lot more um images they had a lot more movies it was a lot more colorful we're on a, a lawyer's website there was a lot more text the language was far more difficult and this really helped me to create my own website which was on for example spotify and i was able to have my spotify targeted at you know teenagers to adults and i kept the color scheme based around the greens and the blacks which is looks more professional uh, but I did you know just talk about what you did and why you did it all right so you bring out what you've done in your research and you flip it in this is why I made my decision helped you how to give yourself ideas about the type of interface features available for you to create on your website so having a look at the way that the websites the websites in the real world have been created should have given you some form of an idea of how to create your website what to put on there how large to put your icons if you're going to do your navigation bar you know none of the websites have the navigation bar on, on the right hand side they're all on the left or up the top some have got drop down lists talk about this is what I researched and this is why I made the decision to put my navigation on the left because you don't want to be scrolling across to the right if the page is not fitting right to go and find your navigation bars. You know, no customer is going to be doing that. No user of your, your website. Talk about what you did and why you did it. You research the house style and ethos of different websites. Looking at different websites helps for a different target audience. So children versus adults, male versus fe female helps how. Did it help you decide on what color schemes you would use for your target audience? So talk about it. You chose a specific app. Why did you choose that color scheme? Did you adapt it anyway? Why did you adapt it in any way? 